Welcome back, Legendary Potato here, and today I want to show you guys a really cool x-ray glitch from Minecraft Java Edition. It's a really cool x-ray glitch. I want to show you guys how you guys can do this, Minecraft 1.12.2. Uh, so it's really simple, really easy, and really cool. Works in survival and creative mode, and I want to show you guys in today's video how you can do that for yourself. So hopefully you guys all will enjoy the video. If you do, make sure you do leave a like and all that sort of great stuff, but let's get right into it here. So. Basically, what this x-ray glitch allows us to do is it allows us to see under the world, which you probably are familiar with x-ray glitches. That's probably why you're watching this video. Let's go ahead and get started with how we're going to do this x-ray glitch. It's very easy. It requires a few things uh, that you're going to need. It is a little bit complicated, but also kind of simple. So let's go ahead and get started with that. So you're going to need a sticky piston, redstone, lever, redstone lamp, and some blocks just in case. So you can pretty much do this anywhere you'd like. Uh, I guess I can do it. Um, I don't know. I could go underground a little bit. I could also do it on the surface. It doesn't really matter too much. Uh, I'll kind of go into here just a little bit. Uh, but you can do this wherever you like. You can see uh, quite a lot of stuff. I think I'd recommend you do it underground. But I'll show you guys on the surface first because it kind of does work there too. So what we're going to do is we're going to place uh, a sticky piston uh, as well as a redstone lamp. So uh, the redstone lamp is important. That's what makes it work. And uh, it's all very helpful stuff there. So I'll place a block uh, right under the sticky piston. So it'll be like this. So make sure there's a block there. That's basically what's going to allow us to power it with our one piece of redstone. That's all you need to do. And uh, we'll just go ahead and place in uh, blocks here. Uh, just so that we can kind of do this and so press the lever and you're going to see that there's a giant redstone lamp in your face But that's okay if you press the F5 key go into third person uh, You will be able to see is that we can x-ray glitch through everything We can see exactly what's going on around the world, which is really cool And if your red distance is uh, very far then you'll be able to see some really cool stuff as well But yeah, it looks like I can see some caves and it looks all weird when it's all loaded like that look at that That's kind of strange um, but yes, yeah, so as you can see, you can see all this sort of cool stuff and see how much is loaded in, which is always kind of nice as well. Um, so I don't see anything too notable, or at least as far as structures go. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and let's go and get out of here. Let's try the same thing again, but further underground. But that's basically the idea of it. Oh, did I just put that on my thing? I don't want that there. So uh, yeah, that's basically how simple it is. So let's just go ahead and travel along a little bit. Let's just go down. Um, this way I think sounds good so we'll just kind of travel along here kind of get past this a little bit see if we find anything more interesting but basically the the basic principle of it is that we're able to use a redstone lamp and we're able to push it inside our face and that lets us see uh, outside the map in third person which is always kind of nice and so there's a creeper there uh, but be careful when you're digging straight down uh, you could run into a cave you could run into lava um, so just be careful if you're digging down uh, but ooh, we found some iron and there we go okay so we've hit bedrock go up a few blocks and then we can go ahead and dig over here and do what we just did before sticky piston uh, redstone lever like that redstone lamp and just place some blocks here so that when you get pushed uh, you will not be pushed outside of it because you gotta have blocks here otherwise you're just going to be pushed to the side won't do anything very interesting there uh, wow there's absolutely nothing oh okay so there's like some stuff but like not as much as I would have hoped but yeah I can see inside my face a lot um, an easy fix for that of course uh, you can just give yourself potion of invisibility which is uh, one of these gray looking potions they all kind of look the same if you look at them quickly so let's go ahead and do that really quick uh, and as you can see you can see so much more now uh, now that I'm out of the way uh, so let's go ahead and take a look see if we can find anything interesting around here but it doesn't seem like we have many cave systems uh, around this area, which can happen. Sometimes you won't find as many cave systems as uh, you would originally hope, but that's just sort of a thing there. Um, oh, yeah, it's kind of weird when it loads. I don't know why Java Edition does that, but it's like really annoying. Like, boop, 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 da, da. I don't know. Um, that's kind of a little strange if you ask me. Um, I don't see anything that would be worth going towards, at least in a survival situation. Um, yeah, we don't seem to be too close to anything. I don't see any diamonds or any uh, sort of cave nearby. So let's just go ahead and get out of here and uh, let's try that again in a different spot would be a good idea. I don't know where my tunnel thing was, so now I'm like kind of confused. There it is. Okay, so let's go ahead and get out of here. 
and uh, I'll do this maybe one or two more times uh, but it is very easy to set up and you can take everything with you uh, so it really does not take all that much to do this so let's just go and get back into first person there uh, so pretty cool stuff we'll go we'll travel pretty far away it uh, does not really matter what biome you're in, just as long as you can dig down somewhere in a good spot. Kind of get some distance each time you do this so that you're not looking at the same places every single time. Uh, and you should be good to go. So I think we've gone pretty far uh, at this point. I think we can start digging down here, see if we find anything cool. Um, but it's totally possible we could, totally possible we could not. Um, but it's all kind of luck and how good your seed is. Um, so you could totally find a lot more than I'm finding. You could potentially find less, which I don't even know how that's possible because I've found like absolutely nothing. Um, but all entirely possible here. So we'll go ahead and check this out. And we'll do one or two more times of this. Actually, I'll do this on the other side. I don't think it matters too much, but um, that is the side I came from. So do this. Uh, sticky piston, redstone, lever, uh, redstone lamp. And I'll just kind of do this just so that uh, I can see it a little bit more upwards. Okay. And there we go. So we're going to F5. And let's see. So there's a lava pit right there. Uh, some caves. Something above us. Um, hmm. Again, nothing really noticeable here. Um, so yeah, I don't know what it is. Just sometimes it can be really unlucky. Uh, but it is a working x-ray glitch, which is the point I'm trying to get at, of course, is that it is helpful. You'll probably be able to find something. You can set this up uh, at your base, see if you can find anything cool around there or whatever you want to do, of course. Uh, so, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I'm hitting the wrong keys for some reason. Uh, so let's just go ahead and let me see where the light is because right now I can't see anything. And I don't know if you guys can see anything either, but I'm scared and I can't see. So that's the thing. I'll just give myself night vision and we'll, we'll try out. Um, try on the other side. So basically it's very easy to switch sides uh, just by, I'll just fill this in real quick. Uh, you can switch the side just by placing in a few blocks here, do it the other way. Um, so the way you place this down is going to kind of affect um, how well this works because you can uh, put it in a good direction, you can put it in a bad direction, uh, but there's nothing there. There's nothing to see here. So that's just sort of a thing. Um, but yeah, why is it moving to redstone? Oh, that's in my, my right hand, or left hand rather. Uh, that's kind of strange. I must have accidentally done that. I was hitting the wrong keys for some reason. I was like a thing over. Uh, but yeah, looks like we're not getting too lucky. So let's just go ahead and break out of here. I'll try it one more time, see if I can find anything. Uh, but I'm never lucky when I make these videos, which is really sad. But you guys can use this, of course. It is very simple. I don't even think this is the surface. Um, so yeah, we'll just go ahead and get out of here. There we go. Okay, so looks like it's turning night. So slash uh, time, uh, wait, slash time set day. Okay, there we go. I got the commands right. I'm so smart. Um, yeah, so I will run along to... Um, actually, I think that's where I started the video, down that way. So we're, we're just going to go down this way to the snowy area, I guess. Um, I don't know. I don't know why my luck's been bad recently trying to do these. Uh, but you guys probably will have better luck than me. If you guys have worse than luck than me, I would love to hear how that's even possible. But... Uh, I'm sure you guys will be able to find something really cool, and if you do, let me know down in the comments section. But we'll go ahead and take all the way down here, so I'll uh, quit spamming my uh, mouse there, because it's probably a little annoying. Uh, but we'll come all the way down here, see if we get a little bit lucky. Maybe we will, maybe we won't. And, okay, we're probably close to bedrock at this point. I don't feel like digging into it. Uh, yeah, okay, so that's good enough for me. What we'll do is sticky piston, that, lever, done, redstone lamp. All right, we're in. Uh, so let's see. Oop, there's a lava pit right next to me. And that looks like it. Wow, that's really even worse than before. Yeah, so I, don't, I think Java Edition really doesn't generate many caves because, like, this is kind of weird to me. Um, but yeah, you'll be able to find dungeons, strongholds, mine shafts, uh, anything else that spawned underground, you'll be able to find it. A uh, piece of cake with this. You, you'll probably be able to find diamonds if you see the light blue stuff. Um, then you know you're probably in business with that. But yeah, that's the working uh, x-ray glitch for Minecraft 1.12. Uh, so if you do want to use that x-ray glitch, go right ahead. Uh, not too difficult, pretty easy to set up. If you guys did enjoy this x-ray glitch, make sure you do leave a like and subscribe if you guys want to see more glitches like these. I upload uh, quite frequently, so if you guys want to see uh, more just like this one, uh, then make sure you do subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss another upload because, hey, you know, maybe you don't want to miss uploads. Oh, you can't see me. I'm invisible. I have a weird red stain on me, so you probably don't want to see that anyway. Uh, 
But yeah, if you guys want to see more videos, subscribe, all that sort of good stuff. And uh, I think that's going to be about it for me. Sorry I couldn't find much, but honestly, these x-ray videos, I can't seem to ever find anything. I can't ever get lucky. But I just kind of try to prove the point and show you guys the glitch. And you guys can go ahead and do it for yourself, and maybe you'll get better results. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Have a good one, guys. And peace out.